Manufacture of Sodium Hydroxide, NaOH, by Diaphragm Cell. Principle Sodium hydroxide or caustic soda is manufactured by electrolysis of an aqueous solution of sodium chloride which is called brine. Here ionization of brine or sodium chloride takes place to produce sodium cation Na plus and chloride Cl minus ion. It is shown in reaction clearly. At cathode sodium cation Na plus takes the electron to give sodium. This obtained sodium react with water to give caustic soda and hydrogen gas as shown in reaction. At anode chloride Cl- ion forms chlorine liberating one electron. The obtained chlorine reacts with another chlorine to form chlorine gas molecule Cl2. Details of diaphragm cell for the manufacture of sodium hydroxide is shown in the figure. Sodium hydroxide or caustic soda is manufactured by the electrolysis of brine in which the electrolytic cell chosen in preference to mercury cathode cells is diaphragm cell because it is relatively more efficient and no health hazard of mercury. Here brine solution means NaCl solution. When saturated brine solution is passed through anode compartment, chlorine gas is collected at the anode, and hydrogen gas is collected at the cathode as shown in the figure. It consists of a perforated steel cathode lined with asbestos. The anode consists of graphite rod dipping in sodium chloride solution that is saturated brine solution and is separated from the cathode by the asbestos lining as shown in figure. On passing the current, chlorine is evolved at the anode and is let off. The sodium ions passes through the asbestos and changes to sodium atom at the cathode. It reacts with steam to form caustic soda solution which is collected at the bottom of the tank and is drawn out from time to time and concentrated. Steam is passes from the bottom as shown in the figure and the prepared NaOH is collected from the bottom as shown in the figure. Details of Diaphragm Cell it consists of a perforated steel cathode lined with asbestos. The anode consists of graphite rod dipping in sodium chloride solution that is saturated brine solution and is separated from the cathode by the asbestos lining as shown in figure. On passing the current, chlorine is evolved at the anode and is let off. The sodium ions passes through the asbestos and changes to sodium atom at the cathode. It reacts with steam to form caustic soda solution which is collected at the bottom of the tank and is drawn out from time to time and concentrated. Physical Properties of Caustic Soda Caustic soda is a white solid which has a melting point of 318 degrees Celsius. Caustic soda is a stable compound. Caustic soda NaOH is bitter and has a soapy feel to it. Caustic soda is highly soluble in water and moderately soluble in alcohol. Sodium hydroxide is strongly alkaline in nature. Uses of caustic soda Caustic soda is used as a cleansing agent and in the manufacturing of washing soda. Sometimes, sodium hydroxide is also used as a reagent in the laboratories. Caustic soda is used in the preparation of soda lime. Caustic soda is used in the extraction of aluminium by purifying bauxite. 